for anyone that was born before the year 2000, or who had been trying to memorize the planets for a test in school, Pluto was a planet. The decision to remove Pluto from our solar system's list was a decision based on several factors. The International Astronomical Union or EOR is the group that names planets. In 2006 they made the decision based on three factors that govern a celestial body being an actual planet. 1. It orbits the Sun. 2. It is round or nearly round. 3. It has cleared out the neighborhood around which it orbits. The third basically means that it doesn't have a bunch of space junk floating around it in its same path. The determination was that Pluto violated number 3 because there were many bodies discovered around it of similar shape and density. This same sequence is how we discovered the asteroid belt between Mars and Jupiter as technology improved, and how we have now named the Kuiper belt which lies beyond Neptune. The new rule for remembering the eight planets' names became My Very Excellent Mother Just Served Us Nachos. Mercury, Venus, Earth, Mars, Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, and Neptune. However, People were not happy. The Harvard Smithsonian Center recently held a debate on whether people thought Pluto was a planet. And guess what? According to the masses Pluto is a planet. The reasoning for the decision? That a planet is a term decided on based on culture, not on science. But when many ancient Greeks were in the beginning stages of astronomy they were in fact using science. So which is it? Is Pluto a planet or is it a dwarf planet, which our solar system is filled with, like science has decided? Well. For right now it is still a dwarf planet. The or doesn't meet again until 2015 and Pluto being a planet or not is not currently on their list of things to talk about. But for anyone hoping it could become a planet again, there is hope. The debate is a first step, the New Horizons spacecraft is a huge second. New Horizons will reach Pluto in July after what may be the most edge of your seat game of real life asteroids. Then, with superior photographs and instrument studies of the celestial body, the debate may come to an end one way or another. For right now the mob has spoken and wishes the solar system was the same as it was before 2006. So I guess it comes down to this, do you think Pluto is a planet? Or do you think it belongs as another dwarf planet or very large asteroid in the Kuiper belt?